What's going on, everybody? Stridebreaker back at it again. And last time we handled the National Park and caught our latest team member, Sunkern, who I'll be naming right before the Whitney battle, which will not be till next part, but, you know, we're getting there. So uh, let's move through this route here. I know this guy is a Kadabra, so yeah, this will be a good fight here. On this route, you can find Stantler, it's a normal type Pokemon. Not a bad Pokemon. I actually learns Hypnosis, which is really good for, uh,. For Morty, uh, the fifth uh, or the fourth gym leader, which will be handling pretty much right after Whitney. There's not that much turnover between the two. So yeah, here comes Sunkern. Uh, I don't think this ever knows anything. Yeah, it just knows Flash. So might as well use Mega Drain because uh, Sunkern is easily our crappiest Pokemon right now. So yeah, let's just drip this thing dry. Actually, let's go for a few growths. Uh, maybe we could take out his Kadabra then. Well, yeah, let's just hope he keeps missing with Flash because. Yeah, I don't want to get flashed by this Abra, god. Abra's dick must be gross. God, okay, I hope... You know, I'm tired of giving you guys images of, uh, Pokemon Genitalia. Maybe I really am one of those, uh, Poke files. God, I'm glad he's not hitting the Flash, but Jesus, Abra. Okay, yeah, Flash lowers your accuracy, it's really annoying. So he didn't hit it all the time, we have four growths up, so it's time to drip him dry with Mega Drain. Pause. I don't think I'll knock it out, though, I think it'll be just short. Yeah, but we kill up all that health, so might as well conserve some Mega Gens with an Absorb, which is just half as powerful. And, ah, there's the Flash. He finally flashed me. Sunkern's like, ah, <laughs> Okay, so down goes the Abra, so there we go. Sunkern doing work for us. The worst Pokemon of all time. Doing well, so here's another Abra, so let's just... Hmm. Is this thing a higher level? Yes, yeah, so let's go for another growth, since we weren't uh, able to finish off the other one in one hit. So actually, we probably won't be able to finish this one off either. And ah, oh, that's two flashes on me now. Because uh, I already had some damage on it from another Mega Drain. So let's see how much this Mega Drain does. We'll probably put it towards the red a bit. Yeah, this is like with five growths up. So Sunkern still is pretty crappy. But growth is a very viable strategy to uh, make Sunkern good. And then once it comes into a Sump Floor, it'll be good on selling. And growth will just be uh, extra help. Yeah, so it's spamming Flash. So I don't think I'll be able to take down the Kadabra. But you know, I might as well get him an Absorb. So... You know, if you could stop flashing me, gosh, why is this one hitting everyone? And there it is, Absorb will finish you off, but no way in hell I'll be able to handle this Kadab with the Flash. He'll probably knock me out in two hits with Confusion anyway. So let's go into our, our Kadabra Killer, which will be Snubble, which... Uh, Chomper, which, you know, I know Bite's super effective, but I have much higher physical attack, Headbutt is Stab, plus this thing has way better special defense than, uh... A special defense than physical defense. I think a headbutt will handle. And I'm out of headbutts. Never mind. Let's just go for a bite. And ooh, I think that was a quick claw there. Maybe it was. Yes, it was. So that's an example of the quick claw there. 10% chance of outspeeding this uh, Kadabra. So can you still lower my accuracy? So I guess your thing is just to annoy me. And bite. Yeah, I'm loving all the flinch luck I'm in. So he's gonna go for a confusion. This thing's very powerful. I'm not fairy type yet. So this might actually kill Chomper. Ooh, can't hit the Thunder Punch! Yeah! Had a boy Chomper! Get a nice chunk of experience on that, too. You won the Gramble at level 23, so. Yeah. Yeah, so yeah, you said you misread me. Also, if you go down there, you could cut down that tree and take a shortcut out there if you want. I uh, obviously find Stantler here. Thanks to my studies, I'm ready for any Pokemon. Yeah, let's get it. This guy's ready, guys. He's ready, alright. So we'll get a Vulpix. So I'll just be yeeting Sunkern out of here. Yeah, so you have a Tangela, actually, which, you know, Sunkern still will no way be able to handle. But Tangela, like, you get another Pokemon. I was actually somewhat considering it. You get Mega Drain around level 31 on it, so it's not a terrible Pokemon. I actually think Tangela is uh, alright. The, the main thing for me was HP, because it has really good physical defense at 115 and a base uh, one, uh, uh, 100 specials attack. So, you know, Sunny Day Solar Beam later on would be able to power it up, but I could have withheld myself of Mega Drain early on. Which I, you can't get it until a little later in the game. But special defense is not the best, and plus it's HP, that's the main thing that miffed me. As you see, it took that ember, impressive. So it was really mostly the special, uh, or the HP that miffed me on it. And I would much rather have a, a Pokemon early on. I would've had to wait till a while to get Tangela. Which I'd much rather have my Sunkern right now. So yeah, I see I'm obviously gonna get the crit there, naturally. Sunkern up to level 16, a boy. Inferno gonna go up. Ooh, just missed that on that level, so Schoolboy Allen is defeated. Yeah, so I'm gonna use an antidote because I don't want to deal with like the poison like humming every five seconds. So yeah, let's uh, use one on Inferno. And I don't think you fight this guy, girl, do you? 
No, you don't. Yeah, so she's gonna talk about this tree. This is pseudo Wudo. Uh, she talks about how you need to spray it with a spray bottle that you'll get after defeating Whitney. So, yeah, just go talk to her or whatever afterwards, and then you'll get your spray bottle. See, so, yeah, how you doing, pseudo Wudo? I mean, random oblivious tree. Yeah, I gotta rip some ass right now. Ooh, ooh okay. Yeah, that was probably a little uncalled for. Uh, so let's uh, get out, hop, actually have it selected. What am I talking about? These aren't the days of Pokemon Yellow. These are the days of, uh, new innovations in Pokemon Crystal. Now, so let's hop on my bike and get riding. Let's go down this tree and hope, haha, a little shortcut here. Let's hope to God I don't run into any annoying ass wild Pokemon. Come on, come on, come on. Ah, uh, yes! Boom. See, actually, there's a thing that you need to do with a sparrow up here, so... Yeah, I'm gonna deposit, uh, let's see, let's deposit, uh, Oddish, or Cutter, we don't need you. Yeah, so the PC system's way better in this game, just everything is way better than this in yellow. So yeah, let's, uh, click select here, and get riding. There's a berry, once you get to surf, you can handle that. So if you talk to this guard here, he'll, uh, give you a Spearow. So it has a mail on it, so you can read, I, I forget if he actually, like, leaves, give you the Spearow, so... Yeah, perfect kid. Yeah, my pal's a chubby guy who snoozes all the time. So yeah, you'll reach him right away. So he gives the Pokemon with mail. It's a Sparrow. Sparrow's not a bad Pokemon. And this guy actually gives this one a solid level. I think it's like level 20, which is stronger than all my Pokemon. So I think that's pretty cool. So I believe its name is Kenya. Okay, so it's at level 10, so it's a mail. Feel free just to keep the Sparrow if you want. And, you know, steal the mail. And, you know, this guy will never get it. He could have just handed us the mail. But go with the Sparrow, which I guess is kind of a cool feature. So let's uh, take this shortcut because, you know, I'm lazy. Because I don't want to deal with any of these wi annoying wild Pokemon. You guys know how much I hate wild Pokemon. And how much I love Repel, which are the greatest item of all time in Pokemon. Like, like don't doubt me. Uh, come on, come on. Come on! Yeah, so I believe you're the guy. Oh, no you're not. Wait a second. Oh, I'm an idiot. You have to wait till after the whole, uh, after the whole, uh, whatchamacallit thing to get this. Never mind. I have to wait until after the trees pass, so, yeah, I'm an idiot, so, yeah, we'll just handle that later. Alright, so let's cut this tree. Oh, I got rid of my Oddish. Wow. Wow, God, I'm freaking stupid. I didn't realize I had my Oddish gotten rid of. Or did I just say Oddish gotten rid of? I didn't realize that the Oddish was the Pokemon I deposited. So, oh, that is stupid. Let's hop back on our bike. Yeah, I don't have to go into our inventory every time. They make this even better in later games. You can just press Y. But, you know, I'm not complaining about this, I assure you. Yeah, so I guess we'll, we'll, we'll put your Spearow away from now and get our Oddish back. And I'll get, we get an HP up for it, so I guess I'll go to it later on. But it's from now on, your Spearow, uh, the mail will not be delivered. Oh, he doesn't even let us uh, deposit it. Oh, no, here he is. Here it is. Remove mail. Yeah, it wants us to remove the mail. Are you serious? Okay. Whatever. I guess Spearow will stay in our party for now. Yeah, no intention on using the Spearow on my team. Yeah, let's actually fight this guy because it's Magmar, so, you know, might as well fight him. I'm practicing my fire breathing. Yes, you are, my friend. Yes, you are. So, yeah, obviously not going to fight him with Sunkern, but we'll give the rest of the team some experience, uh, preferably Quaker. It is Magmar, which is a really powerful Pokemon for this point in game. One, you can Magby, it's a baby Pokemon from uh, the Odd Egg. So yeah, maybe if you go ahead and do that. So let's uh, send in Quaker. Okay, uh, what do you... Well, actually, let's see here. I get the stab from this. So Rollout's going to be just as powerful as Mudslap, so I might as well just go for Rollout and power it up if I don't knock this thing out in one hit. Go for smog, don't hit, don't hit, yeah, Matt. Ah, oh, speed tie. Oh, fire punch, crap. Uh, is that gonna kill me? No, it's not, thank god. Yeah, fire punch, really good on Magmar. If you get a mag, we definitely give a fire punch ASAP. Gonna get a whole chunk of experience from that. So yeah, I think he has like some crappy Volpix now or whatever. Or no, another Magmar, so might as well stay in and give this thing another rollout instead of switching out to Sunkern. So I'll do it. This one's a little stronger. It's gonna hit me with a small. Gonna miss. This rollout will hit. Oh, the rollout missed too. So let's just get the rollout combo going again. Which this one honestly is probably gonna kill Quaker. Quaker's forte isn't really. Oh, critical hit! Come on, get a crit with rollout, Quaker. I know you can. If forte really isn't handled special and attack, special attacks, which it's gonna kill me right now. Quaker's much more of a physical Pokemon. So yes, Quaker is now dead. So might as well switch out to Sunkern to get uh, him to experience or her. And I always get the gender signs mixed up. 
So, uh, let's go, uh, Chopper's probably gonna die, so let's go to Inferno. Yeah, Chopper really acclimated with the team nicely, to be honest, and he's gonna be great when he, once he's a Grand Bull. Yeah, so your Fire Punch isn't gonna do much to my Inferno. Boom, let's nail this thing with a Headbutt. Wait, what am I doing here? Okay, Headbutt. And Magmar's not the best physical defense, so Headbutt. Full finish out, getting Inferno up to level 20, which is Sunkern level 17, so... Sunkern making rounds in this world. Yeah, Fire Breather Walt was defeated. It's Walter White, guys! It's Walter White. He, he's cooking, guys. Where's uh, Jessamon? The Jesse Pokemon. Okay, that was, that was a little cringe. Yeah, luckily we're just gonna be able to keep riding our bike out of here, so this is good. Uh, uh yeah, so there's some... Okay, so I made it a point. So I know I keep saying I'm... I know I keep saying I made a point. Oh, you seem important. What do you have to say? Yeah, oh, this is the other name raider. Or there's only one, what am I talking about? We'll be, we'll be uh, talking to you later on. So I made it a point, because I know there's hidden items in here that I just completely forgot about. I don't know why. So I better go back in here and handle it. I don't know why I forgot about all these hidden items. I know that there's uh, some. I believe there's a paralyzed healer right here. Like, I, like, I researched, like, all this stuff before and thought, like, okay, this is what I have to do. But I completely forgot about it. So I think there's, like, a hidden super potion up around here. So, uh, if I can't find it, it's whatever. But I know it's around here. So, yeah, here it is, super potion. As you guys know, I'm not going to pass up this free stuff. I'm a freaking cheapskake. Cheap steak, whatever you want to call it. Okay, yeah, and all these people are handled. Da, 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 da. Oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no, there we go. Also in the department store, you can do a trade or you can get him a chop. So if you're having trouble with Whitney, uh, in gold and silver, it's for a drowsy. In this game, it's for an abra, which makes things even harder. But you get him a chop called Muscles, and if you're having trouble with Whitney, it's a good fighting type. It could really help out against her, so I recommend then to... So yeah, now we need to go into uh, this radio tower, which, you know, the rock people have taken over. Or not yet, they're going to. So I have to climb up here because uh, Whitney's hanging around here, I believe. Yeah, so they're talking about the radio person or whatever. So I know Whitney's around here somewhere. I think she was just down there. So you know, it's our very own blue card. This will essentially, what the blue card will do is we can like do trivia and get like prizes or whatever. So yeah, I guess, I guess that's kind of cool. So did I just miss Whitney? Where is she? I love Mary from the talk show. Yeah, yeah. Ben, yeah. Okay, what do you have to say? Are you uh, a special quiz campaign? Okay, yeah, this thing right there. So we have to answer five of these questions uh, correctly, and then, you know, we'll be fine. So, yeah, I'd like to take the quiz. So, is there a Pokemon that only appears in the morning? Yes. Correct. Question two. Is this statement correct? You cannot buy a berry at the Mart. I don't think you can. Okay, what? You can? Bullshit. Okay, yeah, special quiz campaign. So I guess I'm just getting these wrong. Okay, so I got yes, no. Yes, I would like to take the quiz. I, you literally just told me this. I don't get why there's a big issue with it. Gosh, I have anger issues. I guess I know this one's going to be a no. Wait, 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 hold on. Did you, like, switch it up on me? I, sw I just could have sworn I said yes. Did, like, can you comment below and see if I, like, didn't, like, shift down correctly? Okay, yeah, so I'm gonna take the quiz. Is there a Pokemon that only appears in the morning? Yes. Is there correct? You cannot, you can't buy, oh, wait, no, it's a yes. What am I talking, I answered no the second time. I'm a freaking idiot. Does HM2, yes. But does he dang cut? Are you serious? It was the first HM that we actually, yeah, we've gotten Flash already. You could screw off. Like, you could screw off, lady. Okay, so I got yes and yes. Yes, yes, no. Okay, yes. Yes. Which... Okay, yeah, so I just didn't interpret the question right. I knew you couldn't buy berries at the market. I just didn't say it right. Falcon or Violet City Gem. Yes, he uses berry Pokemon. What are you going to say? Oh, no, use a flying-type Pokemon. You're technically wrong. No. Okay. Does the Goldenrod Corner slots have Charmander on their reels? Oh, God, I don't know about this. Let's just say yes. No! We'll have to redo this entire thing now. I hate this. I don't know. I don't... I don't... I just buy my coins. I buy my coins one step at a time. Question one. Is there a Pokemon that only appears in the morning? Yes. Okay, question two. You can't buy berries at the mart. Okay, yes. Uh, question three. HM... No. Okay, question four. Falconer. Yes, and now we got another no. 
I swear, this would be the type of thing you would do. They would say, no, use the flying type Pokemon, you idiot. Okay, boom! Got this. Bingo, you got it. Congratulations. Here's your prize, a radio card. A radio card's quite useful, so yeah. Now I can use the Poke, uh, uh, Gears of Radio, which, you know, is a pretty cool thing. Hi, are you a lucky number? Go check your ID numbers or your Pokemon. If you get a lucky number, you win a prize. Let's see if I win a prize or not. Nope, I don't win a prize, because I suck, I guess. Yeah, she just kind of says welcome, so, you know, we gotta hunt down Whitney in this joint. So where is Whitney? Where are you, Whitney? You gotta hunt down Whitney. Oh, did I use, like, use my Pokey or something? I completely forgot to use. Sorry, I'm more of a heart gold and soul silver person. No? God, that was really underwhelming. Actually, I think Whitney's just in the gym, isn't she? Am I, I'm just thinking about this from Heart Gold Soul Silver. No, she's in the gym. Yeah, sorry, guys. I, I, don't, I haven't really played these games that much, so I'm kind of rusty on So I think she's just in the gym. So, yeah, that's a big rip on me. Sorry about that. I tried to give an accurate guy, but I'm not really that good at it. But for the most part, I think I uh, educate you guys pretty well. Yes, she's just in the gym, right? Yes, she is. I'm a freaking idiot, guys. Probably should cut that out of the video, but I don't think I will. This has been Stride Breaker. Make sure to like, comment, and subscribe, and I'll be seeing you guys next time.